I I see gambling's become kind of fucking big these days. That's a little dangerous. I've never had a problem with it, but uh, I see a lot of young people. Not here, not necessarily here, but I was watching, and it's, it seems a bit dangerous. Uh, I think. When you see one of your favorite streamers get like a huge payday and you're like an impressionable 15, 16 year old. Your favorite streamers get like a huge payday and you're like an impressionable 15, 16 year old. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me think about this. Wait a minute. Isn't, isn't, isn't that kind of like when we used to open the cards? Like you did on the on his stream, where we opened the cards have a whatever value that is really marketed for children. Wait a minute. And then we screamed when we got a card that was worth four, five, six thousand. Hold up. Guys, I'm seeing some similarities here, boys. Guys, I'm seeing some similarities. XQC reacted to your take on gambling streams. He got you good. I'm sure he did. He's wrong, dude. Gamba's fine. Now he probably brought up Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh card openings, which is a low IQ take to compare blackjack losses and actual gambling to opening fucking cards, where all you do is lose money, which is the fun of it. Thanks to tier 1 meth smoker. I saw LSF taking that stance. This guy opened Yu-Gi-Oh and Pokemon cards. Hypocrite. Like how dumb do you have to be to compare literal fucking gambling to opening cardboard. Where I literally say every time it's net losses for fun. So okay. So I looked this up because someone sent me this in an email. Why is LSF so fucking awful? Like, holy shit, this whole gambling thing is so pathetic. A, I didn't even call XQC out. XQC reacted to me talking about gambling when someone was bringing up sponsored gambling streams. So XQC's reaction was to something I didn't even call him out for because I haven't fucking watched them do it. And then everyone attacks the opening cards thing. I would love if someone could find me any evidence that someone's life has been ruined over opening cards. It's not the same type of gambling. You're opening cards, and all of us saying how it's a net loss, and it's just fun to collect the shit. No one has sold any of those $10,000 cards that we all pretended were PSA 10. It's a fucking joke. Like, LSF has to be the most socially unaware of the most basic social cues. It's incredible. Y yes, by definition, you're gambling because you're... Alright, I don't even know if he's, like, memeing anymore. What? How can a guy be that successful and that insecure? Does he just burn bridges for the sake of it? Like, he did the same shit with Hassan. You can watch the clip back. He was literally gambling when I was streaming, I, I had no idea. What? It, it has to be a meme, there's no way. Well, that's- See, this is what I'm fucking- between just going and goofing around with the, the chump change, whatever you're playing, what, well, granted, relatively speaking, losing 30k for XQC is the same as if you lost a $5 bill, but there's a difference between that and getting paid to do it, to promote it. There's a fucking massive difference. And there's a big difference in and of itself between blackjack, roulette, slots, poker, than there is to fucking gambling going for a piece of cardboard. Nobody's losing their entire lives over chasing a goddamn Pokemon card. People's lives are ruined all the time over chasing a jackpot. Huge fucking millions of dollars that they believe they can win on a slot machine. So getting paid to promote it super fucking different. God damn it. I, I understand you guys know that, but LSF seems to have drawn some kind of crazy mental bridge. Or wall, not bridge. Bridge um. would imply that they were trying to understand and get across. They just built this fucking wall.
<laughs> Yo, also, this is a message to uh, live stream fellas, okay? This is um director of investor here, okay? Uh, live stream fellas, you guys banned the RP clips for two weeks from the live from the from the, from the live stream fellas Reddit. Um, the content on the uh, on the Reddit has been dog shit. It's been trash. It's uh, a bunch of manufactured bullshit, and that's coming from me of all fucking people. Now, now. Un unban, unban, because it's running out of content, out of juice, okay? Okay, fix it, okay? Now I'm gonna go to bed, then you're gonna fix it. Alright, man, peace out.